I'll tell you what, though, I'm gonna take another little 15 minute break. But while I'm gone, the AV department put together a nice little yearbook for y'all. So y'all enjoy that. And when I come back, this year's prom king and prom queen. All right? See y'all in a minute. Go upstairs. They're gonna announce king and queen. The DJ's taking a break, and he's gonna come back and play a couple other songs, so. You don't care about this at all, do you? What's to care about? What if Ronnie wins king instead of you? What if he does? He's her boyfriend. I have to be crowned with her boyfriend? Look, Ronnie's the starting quarterback. Oh, all city two years in a row. Yeah, Chrissy, you could do a lot worse. <laughs> Besides, Maybe you won't even win. All right, look, I'm gonna go upstairs. Just call me when it's time, okay? If he were any dumber, I'd have to water him. I wanna make a toast to my little queen, no matter what happens. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> if that <laughs> wins, I swear, <laughs> I'll hurl. <laughs> OK, I'm sorry, but just explain to me, why do you care so much? Because what do you get? You get like a bouquet of roses and a tacky tiara you can only wear at proms. It's not about what you get. It's, it's, like, it's about the honor, you know? It's about the respect of my peers. <laughs> right. Okay. Oh, your peers. That's the geekiest thing you've ever said. Okay, I guess it was a little geeky. But seriously, I just want Chrissy to know that she can't buy everything. And think about the reunions to come. By when? It'll eat away at her till the day she dies.